Let's move on to the second part of this section, PowerPoint Operation Interface. When we enter into the beginning interface, we can see several buttons on the interface. These buttons can create Word, Excel, and a PowerPoint document. The software can also open and the PDF document. In this course, we mainly introduce the usage of WPS PowerPoint. Double-click the presentation button. We can enter into the presentation interface. Click blank to create a new presentation. Let me introduce the different functions of each operation bar. First part is a date and display area. We can add text here. We can also see the animation effects here. The second part is menu bar. In order to edit the presentation, we need to know the following six functions. Click Home tab. We can use Paste, Copy, Format Painter. We can also begin the slide. We can add a new slide here. We can also use Layout. Click Insert. We can insert many materials, including new slide, table, picture, shapes, and charts. We will introduce these in detail in the later sections. Click Design. We can choose various PowerPoint templates and colorful design. We can also change the color schemes and use a Deep Slide Master here. Click Transitions. We can choose a transition between two slides. Click Animation. We can add effect to the materials. We can also click Custom Animation to design effects on our own. Click Slideshow. We can choose the ways of display, including from the beginning, from current slide. We can also add speaker notes. The notes will display in this area. Now that we have learned about the basic information about creating and editing a presentation, we can try in practice.